Have you ever wondered what lies beneath the ground? Beneath those steel circle plates all across the city? They're often referred to as manholes, but today are called maintenance holes, and they serve an important purpose in the access, maintenance, and upgrade work for various utilities. In order to make way for the tunnel for the Green Line LRT, several utilities are being moved across downtown, and this includes many electrical utilities managed by NMAX Power Corporation. NMAX Power owns, operates, and maintains the transmission and distribution system in and around Calgary. This system serves approximately 570,000 customers across 1,089 square kilometers. To make room for the tunnel along 2nd Street Southwest, NMAX Power is installing a new maintenance hole at the corner of 6th Avenue and 2nd Street to reroute existing cables. There are many steps involved in the process, but the most critical early step is providing a safe work area for the people completing the job. Because the hole is deep in the ground where the maintenance hole will go, a temporary shoring wall on all four sides is required for worker safety as the excavation progresses down. This process is referred to as lagging and involves driving soldier piles made up of steel I-beams deep into the ground to act as vertical bracing. Large pieces of timber are then slotted in between the piles. Lagging limits the horizontal movement of the soil behind it. Once the hole has been dug to the required depth and is secure, the ground is compacted and a test is run to ensure the ground is suitable for the placement of the very heavy concrete structure that forms the bulk of the maintenance hole. Steering clear of nearby traffic and pedestrians, a large crane is brought onto site and positioned to execute the lift carefully. The maintenance hole comes in two parts and allows for comfortable future access for technicians to perform any required work. Once the maintenance hole is set and leveled, backfilling and removal of the lagging is completed. The next step is creating what's called a duct bank, which is a series of pipes or conduit that the electrical cables run through. At this site, the team installed 27 different pipes to accommodate the relocated utilities. Concrete is poured around the pipes to encase them so any future digging by machines doesn't inadvertently strike the pipes and live electrical cables. Though the ground is always checked before digging to ensure no pipes are hit, this is an extra precaution that provides an even greater degree of safety and reliability of the system. Finally, the area is ready to be returned to its original state. The hole and ditch are backfilled and compacted, and then asphalt is poured before the fences are taken down and traffic can flow freely again. This maintenance hole installation is just one of many complex utility relocation projects happening downtown to make room for the Green Line LRT, which is the largest infrastructure project in Calgary's history. The Green Line Built Video Series takes you behind the scenes of some of the most interesting construction moments. 